Hebrew Israelites from the tribe of Judah, the Lion of Judah. So who is the real Jews, the chosen ones? Hebrew Israelite, the kingdom of God. It's God's kingdom in the Bible. And you have 12 tribes from Israel. The Lion of Judah, 777. The tribe of God, the warriors. So I am from the tribe of God fighting. They are the soldiers, the warrior tribe. So you have different tribes. Like the tribes in Africa, they say that the Ghanaians, Ga, my grandfather was Ga. They say that they come from God. In Africa. And they are the real Jews. So it's not a country, it's a kingdom, the kingdom of God. It's spiritual. Lion of Judah. I am a lion. The lion of Judah. Sealed by God, 777. The 144,000 chosen ones. Fighting in the front. Saint Michael the Archangel defend us in battle against the wickedness snares of the devil. May God rebuke him. We humbly pray. Amen. Today I was in church. Filmed. For my music video. On Swedish. was in a Catholic church, Swedish church, but the church is inside, but it's nice to go sometimes to the church and sit there, pray, look, get inspiration, read some Bible words, and many churches are fake. It's just a church, it's materialistic. Even Jesus was angry in the church. Because they be the most fake. Religious people, they be the worst. But it's nice to go to church, you meet other people, you talk. You go there with your family, alone. But it's more tradition and religious. It's a relationship you create with God. The Holy Spirit, it's inside. But it's nice, I like churches, it's beautiful, I like buildings. To go and see and to go inside. To see how it looks like. Church, mosques. It's beautiful. It's amazing. But uh, the church is inside. You can pray out in the nature. You don't need to go to church. 
in your room, when you walk, everywhere. All the time you can sit, you can lay down, you can stand up. And uh, yeah, the Lion of Judah, sealed by God, the chosen warriors, the mighty army. Zion, lion, be bold like a lion, David fighting Goliath. So it's war in this world and we fight for peace, we fight for God with his holy angels. And it can be dark sometimes, but we are the light in the darkness. And you have to pray. Seek God. And be strong in your mind, spirit, soul. Don't let the devil in. It's a war against the devil. And he gonna lose. And God gonna win. But you can't be kind to him. He's not kind to you. He gives and he takes. There is no peace with the devil. There is war. There is no love against the devil. You can't love the devil fake love you have to destroy him the demons they tremble in fear when they hear Yeshua Jesus and we are the Hebrew Israelites I was thinking about that I'm from here, I'm from there, my mother is from there, my father is from there. And maybe I'm not from them. I'm from them, but I'm from God. So I'm a Hebrew Israelite. I think Jesus was like me. He was brown. Imagine if he trained, of course, he was fit, he was strong, he was a fighter, Jesus, he had a good heart, he was a good man, nobody was like Jesus, king, he walked on water. Be like water, my friend. Even Bruce Lee got inspired by him. Everyone, he saved the world. He came, he fight. He wasn't afraid to speak up. For the poor. For the young, for the old, for the women, for the children. Everybody liked him, and some hated him, the world hated him, the Roman Empire, some people followed him. Judas went against him. Look what they did in uh, the Olympics. They paint him up as a homosexual. They are uh, 
the devil, the ones who control the world. They don't have respect for God, for Jesus. They made fun of him when he died on the cross for us. And they made a picture homosexual picture about Jesus it's crazy man and they burned the Quran they don't have respect for God but that's how the world is they hate full of demons but uh, they will pay for what they did they mock God think they are better than God think they are God The God of this world is Satan, but he who is inside of us is stronger than he who is in the world. I'm from here, I'm from there, but I never felt like this was my home. And uh, in my family, but God is my family. You know what I mean? I think I'm a Jew, Hebrew, Jew. Israelite. The chosen ones. God shows us to be chosen, a chosen generation. And you didn't know before, but then you learn. Then you go through this warfare and spiritual battle and awakening. And it's a fight, it's a fight against the devil. You need to fight every day. You can't let your guard down. The moment you become weak, bam, he comes in. You always need to have your guard up. You can't take it easy. When you rest, when you sleep, they attack out of nowhere. You have to stay in prayer, read the Bible, if you fall, get back up again, fight the flesh, fight Satan, fight the word. So it's a fight every day, you can't let him knock you, you have to knock him out, you have to punch hard and kick hard in the spirit. It's like a fight, you have to keep your guard up, you have to fight, you have to punch, you have to kick, you have to train hard for the battle. It's like before a fight, you need to train, you need to be strong, so you need to pray, you need to fast, you need to work out. So he can come to anyone, he can work in people around you. Someone you love, they are not as strong in the spirit. Demon can possess people and jump in. And you have to rebuke the demons in Jesus Christ's name, Amen. 
they fear Jesus. Jesus have the power over every demon. On earth, in heaven, in hell. The demons, they tremble in fear. You have to have faith. Faith can move mountains. Faith is important. If you don't have faith, You don't have nothing. It's all about faith. Faith in God. Faith in yourself. Faith as a mustard seed can move mountains. And imagine if you have strong, big faith. So be confident in God, be confident in Jesus, be confident in the Lord. I'm confident in God, in Jesus, when I'm afraid. When it's hard, I put my trust in the Lord, in God. And He gives me strength. He gives me power. Jesus is King. You have to rebuke him. You can't give your energy to everyone. You have to be kind, but be wise. Because they will use your kindness as weakness. If you let the devil in, he will take everything. So you have to Stand your ground and remember that you have the power, you have the strength. If you have God, that's all you need. It's much stronger than their witchcraft, witches, warlocks, haters. They fear God. They fear themselves. Fear not. Banish fear and doubt. Remember the Lord is with you wherever you go. So we should not fear them. This mighty army. There are many. We are less. But we are stronger. It's like David going against Goliath. Goliath was big. He was a giant. Philistine guy, giant. A champion. David was small, but he won. He ripped his head off. He jumped up on the giant. He was a fighter. So God is a God of war, also of love. It's war against the devil. You have to rebuke, kill the demons. Destroy them, throw them in fire. <laughs> you have to have endurance and fight and be strong because many people in the Bible, prophets, they suffer, they went through a lot. God tests you, your mind, your spirit. If you're strong, He gives His hardest battle to His strongest soldiers. So when the devil attacks, remember that God is with you. And He wouldn't attack you. so hard
if it wasn't for God. That means that God is for you. So who can be against you? Yeah, they can be against you. The world, the demons, these people. But everything gonna work out for you. Because you're chosen, you're unique. You have this light over you. And you suffered a lot. But you suffered for something good. You have to suffer in the flesh and rebuke it in Jesus' name. And be strong. So we are the Hebrew Israelites, we are the soldiers, we are God's chosen people. So why am I chosen? How do I gonna make it? What is our mission? Sometimes you don't know but you have to find it out. And God will show you, God will lead you, God will help you, and He will provide. Sometimes you don't know. What's going on? And how are you going to make it out? But we made it out alive and we're still alive. And it's all a test. You have to keep going forward and read and pray fight and continue to go after it because God has something special for us all and you have to give it your all and believe it Then you will get it. Things take time. But it will come in the right time. So we have to keep pushing. Keep believing, achieving. And know that God is with us inside. He loves us, He helps us, He gives us rest, blessings upon blessings. Count your blessings. We are blessed. We are highly favored. Strong. Happy. Humble. And we are going to win. Because God shoots us. He shoots you. Choose me and we fight, pray, and keep pushing. The devil comes everywhere. You need to have your eyes open, to be wise, to be strong. To know when to talk, when to not talk. I know to be around. And don't let the enemy mess with your mind. Manipulate you. Distract you. Destroy you. Gaslight. That's evil. And that's the enemy. 
working inside of these people. So when you are filled with the Holy Spirit, with strength, with power, with God, they can't destroy you, they can't control you, because God is in control. You are in control of your mind. Our soul belongs to God till the day we die and we pray we fast and we continue to go after it we don't stop we stop when we win do not fear them. Destroy the devil. Jave is with us. He will fight for us. He and his angels. God bless all the chosen ones. My brothers and sisters. Shalom.